everybody how y'all doing today well today I'm gonna to talk about the movie called knowing with Nicolas Cage it was an alright movie it wasn't as good as I thought it would be though but uh, it was okay but uh, it did have some good special effects I'll say that I like the part with the big airplane crashing and the big train crashing that was good that was the best part of the movie but this whole angel shit, angels coming down, taking kids to heaven, taking bunny rabbits too, that was just a little corny, I'd say. That was just corny. And then the whole world ends, and that was pretty much the movie. But I have to say, it was okay. Five out of ten. That's as, that's as high as I'll give it. I give a good rating for the plane crash and the train crash. The rest of it wasn't that good. But I did like Nicolas Cage in this one. Usually I don't like Nicolas Cage. I don't think he's a, that much of a great actor. He's alright, but he's not the best actor I've ever seen. But he was good in that one movie where he stole the baby. I think he was uh, raised in Arizona or something. I like him in that movie. He was funny in that movie. But his other movies, Ghost Rider, stupid movie. Don't see it. Do not see Ghost Rider. It's horrible. Terrible movie. Next, I did not care for Next with Nicolas Cage. And that one movie where he hijacked an airplane or whatever it's called, Air Con or Con Air or something, he wasn't that great in that movie either. He just, he he could not keep the accent going. He sounded like a redneck in some of the movie, and he sounded like himself. He was like, he sounded like a redneck, and he's like himself. He could not stay in character in that movie. I don't know why, but he couldn't. And those National Treasure movies can kiss my ass. I don't like that damn National Treasure shit. <laughs> Stupid. Oh, and The Wicker Man, that is the worst damn horror movie I've ever seen. Even the old Wicker Man's terrible. Oh my god, the new Wicker Man's even worse than the old one. Both Wicker Man, the old one and the new one, they're both stupid. Don't bother with them, they're horrible. I have to say, Nicolas Cage tried to be good in that movie, but he could not succeed in that movie because The Wicker Man was just stupid, period. But uh, that's pretty much my review on Knowing. It's an alright movie. But don't kill yourself to see it. Just wait for the DVD, maybe. Maybe they'll have more added to the DVD. But I give it 5 out of 10. Thanks for watching. If you have a movie review you'd like to share, feel free to leave a video response and I'll accept it. Well, I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye. Have a good one. And remember, the world's coming to an end. <laughs> no, it's not. Not yet. They probably will one day. Damn, damn terrorists going to kill us all. That's what's going to be. They're going to nuke us all. We're all going to die. And then we're all burning hell with Satan. And that'll be the end of the world. And God might come by and wave and say, Hey, see ya. I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye.